Oh no! Oh no! Try to catch me howling at the moon. That's not something you see every day, but only at trade night. This is Trevor Lawrence. How are we doing? This is out of this world. Today is definitely the craziest day ever at a car show. A lot of time ahead and a lot of opportunity to, to, to make this place special every day. So. All right, what's going on YouTube? Card Cut 2 coming at you here with a brand new video. And today we are back for another sports card mail day in 2024. Seems like we started the year with quite a few of these and then they have progressively slowed down a little bit. Uh, we have not been buying as much online. We had a lot of luck at shows. So uh, it's, it's been a little bit hit or miss. But we're back again with another sports card mail day. We've got an entire tub full of mail here. So I'm gonna jump right in and see what we got today. As always, I would imagine there's a lot of variety in here, so we'll uh, we'll see how we do. Now, I believe this one is from our friends over at Neighborhood Card Shop out in Lodi, California. That's what it looks like. And some purchases on whatnot. Obviously, we uh, we're on there all the time, and they were running some auctions, so I decided to get on there and see what they might have. Looks like they shipped these really, really quickly though because I bought these uh, just literally a few days ago. So definitely uh, like the packaging and protection so far. All right, let me show you what we've got here. All right, so a couple cool things. Pick this up, Johnny Manziel Black Friday Rookie Auto. This would have definitely been something I was after um, as a younger collector. And then pick this one up, just a Will Levis base uh, base prism PSA 10 see what happens there in in Tennessee not sure who the guy is gonna be but wasn't uh wasn't very expensive I actually think I got a deal on that one uh, another cheap uh cheaper slab here I guess uh, Jordan Addison but it's a PSA 10 this is the optic preview uh, from Donruss PSA 10 I think there's a few more of those in here but I don't think uh there's many tens I think that might have been the only 10 I bought all right let's see what this is just rip this right off here uh, just got another cheap one here, Mike Trout Heritage PSA 10. And then I did like this one. This one's actually kind of cool. Uh, Purdy Orange Wave PSA 10. So this is numbered uh, 59 of 60, but second year Purdy Orange Wave PSA 10. And then a few more here. I know there's one really, really big card in here that I'm excited to, to get to. I actually think it's the last one unintentionally. Uh, another preview from Donruss. Uh, the Optic Hollow of uh, Jameer Gibbs. That's just a nine. And then, I don't know what this one is. Looks like a Bryce Young. All right, so just a Bryce Young Prism uh, PSA 9. We'll see how he does in year two. See if they get any pieces around him. Uh, but for sure, the main one I bought was this one. It's a Jordan Love uh, 2022 Prism Gold PSA 9, 9 of 10. I think Love will be one of those quarterbacks that's got some momentum behind him uh, going into the uh, the 2024 national. So that was a that was a fun addition. But uh, numbered to 10, true gold of Jordan Love. So shout out to Garrett and Anthony for the uh, the, the cool auctions there. All right, now it's just going to be some random purchases. So sheesh. some of these could be uh, eBay, some of these could be whatnot, some of these could be uh, IG deals, a little bit of everything. Um, CNS, this is from Steve. Oh, this is so cool. Check this out. A couple people messaged me about this. I've collected cards a long time and I've never seen a 101 uh, Master Edition from Early Sage. That's obviously the goal for Donnie Nicky. But this got listed for $50 or best offer and I could not have bought it fast enough. So shout out to CNS Sports and Hobby in uh, Plainfield, Connecticut. Uh, for this one, Scooney Pen, all-time Buckeye there, uh, one of one Master Edition from Sage 99, or 2000, 2000, Sage 2000. As soon as this got listed, I had I had uh, I had purchased it. It could not have been up for more than a few minutes. But a one of one Master Edition. These are uh, these are not something. I mean, I've collected Donnie Nicky for 20 plus years, and I've never seen a one of one of him. So to find a big name like Scooney Pen again, I know. Many Buckeye or many non-Buckeye fans might not know about that, but to me that was a that was a cool one. Fishtown Card Show. 
I'm not sure what this is. Fishtown Card Show. Big, long note. Donovan McNabb Refractor. Oh, wow. Um, Ryan, been a uh, big fan of your card show content for, uh, for a long time. Uh, just wanted to reach out with our gratitude. Please use this pass to drop in any time you're in the area. We'd be grateful to have you. Thanks for all you do for the hobby. Uh, Fishtown Philly Show, Cherry Hill, New Jersey Show. I can't read the, the name. It's in Sharpie. Starts with a B. It looks like maybe Brett. Not sure. It's hard to read. But let's see what this is. I'm going to keep the note. Oh, wow. Holy cow. All right. So I think this is a shirt. Oh, wow. The Fishtown Card Show. There we go. It's kind of cool. Fishtown Card Show. Never been there. Um, there's that. Upcoming shows. This is pretty good. These are, uh, these are nice. It says where they are. Some of those to pass out. And then an all-access show ambassador pass. Very cool. Wow, very, uh, very creative. I've never, uh, I've never had someone do something this creative around a show. That's, uh, that's pretty good. Um, we obviously love go a good show, and to be proactive with a uh, all uh, access show ambassador pass and a uh, shirt sure, and no, that's that's it's pretty, it's pretty well thought out. So shout out to the Fishtown Card Show. Maybe we'll uh, we'll check it out there. I've never been, but um, yeah, it's cool. Has anybody ever been to the Fishtown Card Show? You have any thoughts? Maybe that or the Cherry Hill Show? Let me know. Be curious if it's a. Uh, what you guys think, if it's worth checking out. This is from my guy, Rick. I know what this is. This is a lot of, I want to say like um, Jackson stuff. Uh, Jackson Smith and Jigba. It's probably got a few different pieces in it. Just don't want to show his address. All right. Julian Fleming on top, former Buckeye, not Penn State. All right, here we go. Jackson, uh, 90 of 175. Uh, Jackson numbered 11 of 125, which is jersey number. And then a, uh, a patch auto from Phoenix. 10 of 49, which is one off his jersey number. And of course, more uh, Julian Fleming, unfortunately, who is uh, at Penn State these days. Not a Buckeye anymore. So, all right, let's see what's in this one. All right, we've, uh, looks like we've got a Panini Redemption. See what's in here. Feels a little thick. Definitely thick. Hopefully it is something good. Matt Ryan, two of five. Matt Ryan is pro numbers too, so that's kind of cool. He wore 12 at Boston College. But two of five, Immaculate Ink, Matt Ryan Auto from 2023 Immaculate Collegiate. Kind of cool. Imagining his Boston College stuff sells well, so. Doubt that's one I'll keep, so it'll likely uh, end up for sale here before too long. All right, looks like we got a Leaf Redemption. I'm not sure what this could be. All right, there's a note, so it's probably like a replacement. Oh, wow, Bryce Young at a 20. Did Bryce Young get it signed? Yep. Redeemed a Bryce Young Pro Set Medal from 2022. And I got 6 of 20. So again, I always talk about this with Leaf. I, I do think it's cool how they do. Uh, you could get any serial numbers. You could get a 101 out of two. You know, Leaf has a bunch of like odd numbers, uh, but six of 20. So not a, uh, not bad, not great. Back to back to back redemptions. This one is from Tops. So we had Panini, we had Leaf, we had Tops, all in the same mail day. Not sure we've ever done that ever. All right, double uh, double padded here. Hopefully something good. Bowman University rushed. It looks like Scoot Henderson. Yep, Scoot Henderson. So Scoot Henderson with the G League Ignite Bowman's Best Auto. Cool. Again, uh, unfortunately doesn't have Pro Uni Auto, so kind of take what you can get at this point of Scoot. So I have a good amount of packages left. There's uh, definitely some stuff in here. I know it didn't look crazy, crazy full in the beginning, but... Oh no. Oh no. That's not good. That's not good at all. Oh no. 
I've never got one of these on a mail day. That's rough. Dude, it's like burnt. Oh no. Something is in here. I mean, we gotta find out what's inside, right? It's smoked. I don't wanna show their address. 6623. 6623. Wow, there's something in here. It's a whatnot, it's a whatnot order. It's a Marcus Allen autograph. Yeah, it's a Marcus Allen autograph. That is, I've done this a long time and I've never ever seen this. Never in my, in my wildest dreams have I seen this. I'm getting it all the way out. There it is, right there. Marcus Allen autograph. That's what it used to look like, and it has seen better days, unfortunately. <laughs> that's uh, that's not good. That's definitely not good. That's uh, that's rough. I almost want to get it slabbed just for uh, you know, see what I can get on it. Just you know, have it pressed down and just have it you know, up back you know, up back there as a little placeholder. That's a uh, that's unfortunate. Wow, that's uh, you guys ever seen anything like that? That's definitely the first time I've ever seen that. All right, back to our uh, redemption. So apparently, we had another one from Panini in here, so I don't know if we have any more, but that is uh, that's something else. All right, gold. Jameson Williams. Wow. Mosaic choice. This is the black gold. This should be numbered to eight. Five of eight. Yeah, five of eight black gold mosaic choice. Jameson Williams uh, auto. Not bad. You guys think he's ever going to do anything there? I know Detroit's got a lot of weapons as is. I mean, they're obviously talented. They got Gibbs. They got Laporta. They got Amonra. They're, there's a lot of talent there in Detroit. Is Williams uh, a part of that future or are they going to get somebody else? What do you guys think? All right, there's that. And then this looks like an eBay purchase, I think. Oh, yeah. I bought this. I have the other 101, so... Um, oh, shout out to Collectible Kings. I didn't know that's who that was from. I bought this on uh, eBay auction. I definitely got it a lot cheaper than the price listed there. Uh, but I have the non-auto 101 and ended up picking the uh, 101 auto up on a on a bid. Don't remember what I was searching, but uh, saw this in auction. I was like, oh, we'll see if I can get it. And I feel like I got a pretty good deal on it. So uh, Caleb Johnson 101 auto um, from Bowman Crumb U. Uh, what is it, Paperdasha? I think I think that's how you say it. If I'm not mistaken. I know I always get smoked for my pronunciation, so we'll uh, we'll see how that one goes. Oh, this is a fun one. This is actually pretty cool. This is actually a pretty big card. There's a note. <laughs> it's a note from my guy B Crooks on IG. Known him a while. Uh, Ryan, much love. Uh, much love, always, bro. Uh, might not mean much. I'm proud of where you are and what you have done. Keep being you. That's why they love you. B Crux. P.S. I'll be waiting on that hoodie. One of one. Uh, I already said B Crux. I know my guy already uh, sent him a, a hoodie. B Crux has been around for a while on our on our supporting us back in the day when we used to run IG lives long long time ago. This is a decade now, so he's been around a while. But he hit this. Um, and oh threw in something else that's actually really cool so i'll show you the bonus card first so i don't ruin this uh adam uh, adam lefko jersey auto from ginter a few of these signed from adam great guy fellow card collector so i picked up a couple of those and adam signed them uh, but then i also got this uh patrick mahomes uh, kaboom from 2023 just can't go wrong buying case hits especially of a uh, guy with as many rings and you know the success that mahomes has already it's it's hard to argue with that. So this is a fun pickup. And again, I always love buying, buying my home stuff. All right, we've got a couple left here. We are running down to the very, very end here. Shout out to those of you still watching. Uh, not sure who this one is from. All right, packaged pretty well here. 
Oh, nice, nice. A couple cheap uh, eBay additions to the PC. Uh, my guy, Brian Hartline. Again, uh, had the pleasure of golfing with him a few times. Just a uh, good guy. Love, uh, love Ohio State, love rooting for him. So one of the best recruiters in the country, but a couple just cheap additions. This is like a second year, this is 2010 SPX, Superscripts Auto, and this is an elite uh, aspirations rookie number 91. Just love fun, unique, uh, cheap PC additions. It's why I enjoy collecting. It says do not bend on the front, but this is thin, thin. Yeah, there's no protection on this. It's just, hey, there we go. Probably overpaid for this, but um, sometimes that happens. Donnie Nicky, numbered to 250. Again, these just don't pop up very often, so uh, to be able to add another one to the PC, a eh, few extra dollars, didn't mind this time, so decided when I saw it, I was gonna grab it. All right, and then last one, ooh. Loot box TV. I do not know what this is. This I do not know. This is from, looks like from my guy John, at loot box, so I don't know what this could be. Oh, goodness. I think it's empty. It says, Ryan, uh, knew the, it says, knew the perfect home for these cards. Juice, loot box TV. Oh, goodness. My goodness, what a guy. As we're talking about Brian Hartline, got a prism silver. I think this is 2015. Uh, yeah, 2014, sorry. Yeah, Derek Carr's rookie here. Uh, and then you got, I mean, logo patch auto, Cotton Bowl logo there of KJ Hill. Uh, Buckeye great KJ Hill. 9 of 20 from Flawless Collegiate. Got the Loot Box TV uh, logo box cutter on it. That's actually pretty cool. So shout out to, to Juice for that. That's uh, that's pretty cool. Appreciate you, Juice. That's uh, that's fun. What a cool mail day. Yeah, that was, uh, that was something different. We got some really, really cool stuff. The, the past package was cool. I mean, the Marcus Allen, that's... Never seen anything like that in my life. Jordan Love, True Gold, some 101, some cheap PC editions, some gifts. That was a that was a fun mail day. So, yeah, we'll uh, we'll have some more mail days here soon, guys. But stay tuned. More cool card content coming soon. Uh, but for now, that's all I got, guys. Peace.